When the focus is only on the adventure that lies ahead, not a lot of thought goes into what gets left behind. Last year we had 69 million people come through Denver International Airport and that can be a lot of trash. So these are all our abandoned bags. Maintenance crews find about 800 pieces of luggage a year near trash cans or even left empty by baggage claim. So we're going to go just down to the end of the loading dock. They bring them down below. Now we're going to go into the truck. Where the Denver Rescue Mission picks them up. Once a week or once every two weeks, depend how much they have. We're very grateful. Last month we had 900 p different people come in and these go a long way for people that need them. Do we have toilet paper today? The donations Three, from DIA four, are also a little five, unusual. Six, so we don't seven, want to strand anybody in the bathroom, right, with not enough toilet paper to get through before our next um, group of cleaning folks come in. So we donate those half-used rolls to the rescue mission. DIA donates around three to four tons of TP every year. And these go directly downtown to uh, help our homeless people out. The things left behind at the airport are the things that help the rescue mission move forward. Oh yes, right behind us are the, uh, the airport luggage. They really do provide us with the quantity we need to be able to serve the mass of people that we serve. The population the mission serves is mobile and luggage in their store where everything is free. Yes is gone within a few days. This store will turn over, I mean, really three times in a week. The toilet paper goes straight to the mission downtown where they serve more than a thousand meals a day. And it's a huge answer for one of our significant needs. Things that aren't given a second thought turned into caring for those who need it most. Oh, they really appreciate those. Katie Eastman, Nine News.